Well, we're back at the CCA workbench with Dave and it's the Taco Marine Trolling the Edge segment. So let's see what kind of new products that we have. Well, we're going to start Dave. with my favorite island lure of all, all time. Right. I, I love the Sea Star. I've always loved it since I came out with the original one a long time ago. This is the Sea Star with the new octopus skirts. They have rubber skirts. If you realize, if you, I mean, if you remember, most island lures come with the nylon hair skirts. Right. But this is the new the new ones with the rubber skirts there okay. called octopus skirts. And uh, like I said, it's my favorite one. It's like, it's got a little jet head. It's got that little uh, rounded bullet shaped head that gives a really tight wiggle, even if you have a ballyhoo in there behind it. I mean, it gets a really tight wiggle on the top and it comes up and pops and smokes really good because it's got those jet holes yeah, all in, in the, the front. front there. And it, you know, it's six and three quarter inches long. Weighs one and one and a half ounces. It's perfect for a ballyhoo. Uh, I like to run it short on the short line, mm -hmm. right up close to the boat. Wahoos love it. Like a, like Wahoos, a flat line or a, a short flat line. I run it on the flat line. Okay. I usually have a, a clip on the on the transom that I run it off of, and it man, Wahoos love that thing. I, I tr troll a black and red one all the time with this with the nylon skirts, mm -hmm. and uh, it gets it gets. Pummeled. Well, what have Pummeled. we got here, Dave? Well, you got to go to shopmirrorlure.com oh. to get you that Island Lure Sea, or, sea Star. Next, we got the uh, <clears throat> spool mount leader holder from Sea Sucker. Uh, this has a built in spring tensioner right here, so you can it, you put your leaders on here and you suck this thing down, and you can have three different size leaders on there. You know, put your okay. leader spools on there. Okay. Uh, four, it's got a four and a half inch uh, Sea Sucker vacuum holder. And it keeps it where you want it. You can do it horizontal or vertical, you know, off the side of the console or, you know, on the top. You just pop that thing down, suck it down, and it, and it, it will down. not move. Yeah. And you can yep. put, you know, you can put a big size spool or you know, in there as well. So that, that spring tensioner keeps everything tight. So, you know, it doesn't go spinning out of control. You know, your leaders don't go flying around don't all over the place. They go flying everywhere. And you can just pull off, you know, up to three different size leaders on there. So Perfect. Seasucker. Seasucker.com to get one of those. Next, we have the uh, top shelf marine products. This is the Battle Wagon Bucket. Uh, you know, most buckets that we used a long time ago had the big wire handles and a little, Love uh, maybe with a little, yeah, maybe with a little plastic handle in it. If you yeah. have anything in it, very hard to carry when the wire handles. Really hard on your hands. These, these rope handles are great for your hands. Not only that, you know, when we used to make our, we used to make our rope handles, we used to drill a hole through the side, but these have the, the, the transition from the rope handle is integrated inside. This is an insert. You know, this is that insert from Trolling Mate the thing. I said, what the heck is this thing? Well, you, you put your rigged lures and stuff in there gotcha. and drop them down in there and it keeps everything keeps separate. When you have free. a bunch, yeah, when you have a bunch of rigs, you know, with a bunch of mono and, and wire and whatnot falling around, you put them in that thing and that from Trolling Mate. Well, and the other thing that's nice about this is instead of them getting all tangled in the bucket and then you trying to figure out what's what. Yeah. You, each individual sleeve and you can rinse them with your fresh water wash down and they're and they're ready to they're ready to dry at the end of the day and go back right and, and they're not tangled up so right. it's got holes in there after as well. after yeah after getting you can see them on the back side after getting kicked around all day in the in the cockpit of the boat it's a jumbled mess so yep. this is this is yep. a, that's a game changer right yep. there they have a hundred different color combinations with ropes and buckets you can put your name company's name on there you can do all kinds of th stuff top shelf marine 10 millimeter bucket it also gets uh they have a optional lids as well so. fantastic next we got the daymaker lure by fishraiser.com you know it's it's designed for tuna fishes uh it, it, it kind of swims like a uh a cedar plug you just put a seven aught hook in the back and let it go i was going to say this thing looks like the the 2.0 version of a cedar plug correct and it's got you know it comes in pink blue and green sparkle that elongated body you know with pulling from the back and that squirt and that squid skirt gives it a great action and uh it's you know if you're you can also order it rigged you need to get it by itself like that or it comes rigged on a 200 pound leader with a nine aught needle eye hook inside of and it. where and where do we find those dave fishraiser.com r-a-z-r -R, razor 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 well brie we got squid all kind of great position. new stuff squid, squid skirt, skirt position it's hard squid to say skirt that. Position. <laughs>